Well, good morning everybody. It's uh, about half past seven in the morning. Uh, my name is Jen, Jennifer, and welcome to my farm. I am currently checking the sheep in the fields. Um, I have just escaped uh, the madness of breakfast and CBBs. This is my time to just have 10 minutes to myself to come and check our beautiful lambs. So we farm in Mid Devon. Our meat is pasture reared. So we um, only feed our lambs that are going to be meat from the grass, from the pasture that we can grow on the farm. So this lot that you can see behind me were born almost a year ago. These are last year's lambs. This is what's left of last year's lambs. And we sell our meat um, solely to a local farm shop who distribute for us. Um, so I used to sell directly to customers, but now I focus completely on doing the best job I possibly can of rearing these beautiful animals uh, to be the best quality meat that we can. I feel very privileged that in the last few weeks since um, coronavirus has hit the UK that I have had uh, this outdoor space to enjoy and to keep me a little bit sane. I'm very aware that there are lots of people who are who are stuck inside and who haven't got the luxury of even a garden let alone a farm to walk around and I hope that in the next few weeks as I make my videos uh, for you that maybe those of you who are watching who can't get outside might get a little bit of um, happiness and peace from um, me sharing my outdoor space. Uh, so if I can pan around slowly you might just be able to see through the hedge our beautiful view. This is the view across the fields and um, I'm going to go back now and uh, show you the lambing shed and introduce you to the girls who will probably be the uh, center of uh, the uh, attraction for the next few videos as they begin to lamb and produce their babies. Okay so we're at the lambing shed if you listen carefully you can hear the girls that's the sound of 50 ladies wanting their um, breakfast. So I'll just show you around and you can see them all. Here they are. This is the maternity quarters. This is them all ready and waiting for their breakfast. So I'm just gonna feed them and um, I will then um, show you them once they've had their nuts. Breakfast time. As you can see, they've all come to the trough and they're all eating. This is a really good opportunity for me just to give the ewes a really good check over. I can see their back ends, see if there's any water bags hanging out, which would indicate they might um, be close to lambing. Check that they all come to the trough and haven't got a sore foot. Um, but as you can see, they've all come to eat, which would suggest that nobody's gonna lamb in the next couple of hours because if they're gonna lamb, usually they take themselves off into a corner and they're not that interested in their breakfast. So having shown you where the ewes are when they give birth, I'll show you and take you next door to where the pens are, which is where the sheep go when they've had their babies. They come in here for um, 12 to 24 hours just to make sure that everybody's sucking um, milk and everybody's healthy and well before they go out into the field. Now you might be able to see in this little pen, under the infrared heat lamp, we have a little lamb who was born a few days ago. He, um, his mummy's not very well, she's out in the field, she's not really got any milk and she's, she's too poorly and she's not really interested in him at all. So we're having to give him um, a bottle. So I have here the lamb bottle full of lamb formula. So this is just like baby formula, but it's especially for lambs. And I thought we'd finish up this week's video by giving this little chap his breakfast. So, come on baby, come here. Come on in, do you want your brekkie? Here he is, here he is. Do you want your brekkie? 
Oh, he says, I'm cosy. I'm cosy. Come here. Can you see his little tail? Little tail waggling. Here he is. Here he is. Come in. And... So it's a have a good week from us. And hopefully next week we might be able to even uh, send you a lambing live and somebody giving birth. Take care. Bye.